There are some things you feel they don't mean anything. They matters the most. Be careful. Shake yourself. Renew your mind. Renew it. Romans 12, 2. Renew it. The renewing of our mind. You, you change. Be smart. As smart the devils. Be smart. I want to thank you especially for joining us. I want to thank you for your love and for all God has been using you to do. I, I have taught you spiritual growth. Spiritual growth. How do we grow spiritually? Spiritual growth. Spiritual growth. And I said before you can grow spiritually, you must know we have laws. You must know we have laws. And if you know these laws, you grow easily. If I came, I saw very many of you are trying to break through and uh, the Lord said, I should tell you, you should just push more. Just push. Don't get discouraged. Just push on. And you break through. Push on. It's so close. Just keep pushing on. Don't give up. Don't get discouraged. Discouragement is for children, for babes. I want to turn my Bible to the book of Acts. Acts of the Apostles 19. I'll start my reading from the 13th verse. He said, a setting of the vagabond Jews. Vagabond Jews. You know what they call vagabond, right? Mad people. Exorcists. Took upon them, them to call over them which had evil spirits in the name of Jesus, saying, We adjure you by Jesus, whom Paul preached. Some mad set of persons woke up and they started casting out devils on their own. They say in the name of the God that Paul is using, you demon, get out. And some of the demons actually were jumping out. And there were seven sons of one skiver, a Jew, and chief of the priests, which did so. There are seven sons of one man of God. He's a man of God. He had seven boys. Their father was a man of God. He's a man of God. So these children were raised in the church. So they felt they can cast out devils, seven of them. And the evil spirit, they met one very tough devil. They'll be casting out devils all this while, these seven guys. And they met this man, and the evil spirit answered and said, Jesus, I know. Paul, I know. But who are you? Who are you? I know Jesus. I know Paul. But you, you, who are you? I could remember many years ago, about seven, eight years now, and a young man came to meet us. Where's Pastor Tao? The young man, uh, uh, mama was there. The young man came to meet us. He said, ah, oh, a lady was behaving somehow. Uh, I think they did a marriage or something. Uh, and after the, after the marriage uh, celebration or reception or whatever they call it, they were somewhere with this lady. And the lady started behaving somehow. And he knew his demon. So he started casting out the devil. Devil, come out, come out. And he didn't look at him like this. He didn't know when he started kissing. You remember? The lady just look. He, he came to confess to us. So I didn't know when I started kissing him before I realized they break. Oh. He wanted to cast out devils, seven sons of Skiva was casting out devils and he does not have that authority, that calling he doesn't have we have a lot of people like this that are doing the work of God without the enablement without the calling everybody is called every one of you is called 
God has called everyone. So if you, somebody comes to meet you and say, God called me. He shall, God called me on the 13th of June. They are fooling themselves. I, I don't even know why God called me. Me, I don't know. My name is Omogene. My mother named me Omogene. So I don't know why God called me. Somebody is telling you, God called me on the 19th of April. He is mad. He needs help. You should go and look for work. Seven sons of Skiva. My father is a man of God. So, who are you to tell us not to cast out devils? They started casting out devils. But now they met this, they met this demon that knows himself. And the demon said, Paul, I know. Jesus, I know. But who are you? Who are you? Can I have the next verse? Spiritual growth. And the man whom the evil spirit was leaped on them. One person who they were seven. And overcame them and prevailed against them. So that they fled out of that house na naked and wounded. They were seven. It's just one person that was possessed. That the demon was speaking through. Just like the way we cast out devils here. And the one man beat the seven of them, strip them off all their clothes, throw them out of the house naked. Spiritual growth. What happened to seven sons of Sceva? They are still babe. They have not grown. They were raised in the church. Yes. Their father was a pastor. Yes. Their mother was a pastor, Dickiness, Mrs. Of, whatever big name. Yes, or Reverend Doctor, or Apostle, or whatever name. You can just write any name. Nobody will question it. Yes. But they are not such at heart. We even have people that are such at heart, but they don't have that kind of calling. We have God-fearing people, God-fearing men of God that know God, that are men of God, genuine. But there are some tasks they want to do that they don't have the, the calling of such capacity to try such thing. They try it, you are in trouble. Calling varies. The Bible said some have given 30, I gave some 60, some I gave hundred. Some men of God are not the same. They have different calling. I'm so grateful that prophet Jeremiah Omoto Fufenyi was here on Sunday and he was telling you that the kind of calling God gave me is what he gave to this man of God. He has the five-fold ministry. I could remember many years ago I was telling my pastors, yes, Yes, it's what he said. Many years ago, I told my pastors, we just started the church, the Lord told me the same thing. That what I gave to Prophet Jeremiah is what I gave to you. Go and work it out. He has worked his own. Work your own out. I told them, I told my wife, I told Pastor Ty with them. They were the only ones we had then. Pastor Ty and my wife were the only ones that were dead then. Every other person here now knew. So callings vary. It varies. The calling. Yeah? If a man of God is praying for you, maybe he does never have any calling at all. Maybe your calling is even more than his own. I could remember many years ago, I would drive all the way from Wari to meet men of God in Ugeli to pray for me. I could remember in one occasion, I, 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 I drove with my wife then to Lagos. To meet a woman of God to pray for me. I've told you the story. One day I went there and I met the woman of God crying. If I die, if I die, if I die, my brother is a soldier. We deal with him. I said, Mommy, they cannot kill you now. Ah, nobody, you are mommy now. Nobody can kill you. She said, I said, Who is even troubling you? It's my mother in law. My mother in law said, I will die. If I die, I said, Oh. See who I pull up. 
A mother-in-law won't kill her. My problem passed mother-in-law. Oh, I didn't look back again. I drove all the way from Wari to Lagos. When I get to Lagos, I shall tell when I start another journey to somewhere they call Fagba in Ogun State. Just to see a woman of God. When I got there, she does never have the capacity to solve her own problem, talk much more of my own. If I had my problem, she would just die. I reversed my vehicle. I drove back so frustrated. Calling varies. Can I have the scripture? I don't want to take your time. And this was known to all the Jews and Greeks also dwelling in Ephesus. And fear fell on them all. And the name of the Lord was magnified. Can I have the 18th verse? I want you to take note of this part. And many that believed came and confessed. It didn't stop there. And showed their deeds. Many that believed came. They confessed. They also brought what they have done wrong. They brought them. Can I have the next verse? Many of them also wish used curious art. Brought their books to get, brought their books together and burned them before all men. And they were counted the price of them and found it 50,000 pieces of silver. They brought their books. See, you cannot say you want to serve God now and you still keep the ring. You still keep the concussion. There are a lot of you like that. You have magic book. You keep it. You can't serve God and mammon. It doesn't work like that. What am I trying to say? Why is it that it's not working for you? That is where I'm heading. Why is it that it has not started working yet for you? Why? Why? Have you ever asked, why has it not started working? It's our year to celebrate. Me, I've celebrated since January. Bought a generator. That is why it's working now. I'll tell you how much you fear. We bought a bus. We brought it. We bought a lot of things. So I've started celebrating my own. I, I'm not a native doctor. If I prophesy that this thing would be like this, I will also enjoy it first. Oh, you don't know. I'm not a native doctor. I can't pray for people to get rich and I'm riding Okada. I don't have that kind of anointing. I have sweet, sweet cars. Huh? Ah. Right? So it's working for me, right? It's also working for you. In this church, we dedicate vehicles almost every day. But I'm asking you now, why is it not working yet for you? Why is it not working? One, you have not grown. Two, you have failed to change. You cannot be doing the same thing, same lifestyle, and you want something new. It doesn't work like that. You cannot be living your life the way you used to live it, 2023. This is 2024, and you want something new. It doesn't work like that. You want to change. You must change. You must practically change. Nobody will change you. It's you that will change. You must learn to change. You shake yourself. What am I really doing wrong? There are some of you that will be saying, I don't do anything wrong. But you hate your old lady. And you are praying for her to die. It could just be pride. You are so proud. Ah, you are so proud. You are so proud. Too proud. Somebody is talking, you say, who is he? Who is he? If God should bless you in addition to this, your pride, you, you know what you will do? You block the road, though. You will block the Potakot Expressway, you. Only you. You block the road. They should know I'm here. So why is it not working? It's because you have not grown. You have choose not to grow. You cannot be a child of God and you are still taking drugs. It doesn't work that way. 
were praying here all night and some brethren were privileged to be invited and I heard my pastors telling one, don't play gambo, it's not good for you. I, I felt bad. You still play gambo, so you still do naira bets. What is wrong with you? Jesus. I was with Prophet Jeremiah day first today also. We were watching the Nigerian, uh, you were there now, Nigerian South African match. And I said, Nigeria will win. Shut up, shut up. Don't say it, don't say it. I said, why, sir? He said, ah, people bet. So I don't want to talk. Because if I talk, it will cause trouble. So he knew, I know that we will win. We were just looking at us, don't say it. You know, they bet, they bet. Even the people around us, they want to take the word from us. So the prophet closed his mouth more. Mm, I don't want to talk. I don't want to talk. And I said, Nigeria must win. Nigeria must win. I didn't know that they were taking the word. <laughs> prophet, are you sure? I said, Nigeria will win. Don't worry. Nigeria must win. And as soon as I said, they will go outside. <laughs> Nigeria will win. Bet, bet. Nigeria... <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> eh? You see it? But the man of God was smart. He said, ah, no, South Africans are here. They are in the mountain fasting. I don't have to talk. I don't know when we know. But let's pray for all of them. This time, you are still betting. What is wrong with you? You could never bet with your wife at home. And they always win you. There are some things you feel they don't mean anything. They matter the most. Be careful. Check yourself. Renew your mind. Renew it. Romans 12 2. Renew it. The renewing of our mind. You, you change. I used to tell lies a lot. I used to be a thief. If I pass you, wow. I mean, how do you first do now? You just say we'll fall come from heaven. I always told you I used to be a devil. I used to be very bad. Though. Even to today, if I stand in Japan Junction, if I will stand one hour, you must hear somebody who will say, Shema. I'm not sure say your level is like that. It's true. I, I told you, I used to be a devil. I used to be very gentle, but very dangerous. That's why I'm here now. You just wish normal pastor or prophet go come this guy for and come this day. Huh? You will not say the person a madman. <laughs> so if I look at you and you have not changed uh, and I've changed, it means you are not ready to change because as at 13 years, I was already smoking in their hand. 13 years old. You smoke. <laughs> Let's go cash fire. <laughs> that will be you first do. We do. <laughs> eh? There is always a story. What am I trying to say? If we can change like this, you can change. We were telling a severe this, this evening out there. We said for nine years we have been running this ministry and we don't have anything that we will remember and feel ashamed or feel guilt. That we have done wrong for the nine years. I don't have anything I can remember that I've done. I, you know, at times you can just reflect, even some of you, even today now, if I say so bad reflection, you, you will feel bad or you don't do some evil today, only today now. You don't rape somebody, you don't dupe somebody, you don't oppress somebody, you don't move somebody from. Huh? But for the nine years we have been doing this job, we don't have anything. We we'll look back and regret. Ah, sorry, oh God. Oh, forgive me. You need to change. On a more serious note, you need to change. Just stop some. Stop some. You practice. There are some persons you must block their numbers. As you are here now, block their numbers. 
Don't waste time. You cannot be a young woman and you are going out with a married man and you expect things to work. Block his number. And another way to change quick, when these people call you, you say, I'm born again now. Ecclesiastes 4 verse 9. You'll just be quoting scriptures. Whether they are correct or not. The person will run. So I live and live and. He's born again now. You cannot be a born again and you are still in a court. The best way to leave the court is to be carrying big Bible. Buy Bible. Bible is cheap. 2000. You bought a big Bible. When they come, they see you with Bible. It's I'm born again now. They will leave you alone. Be smart. As smart the devils. Be smart. Be smart. Change. Let this thing work. We have a very powerful altar here. There is nothing God has not given us in this church. Everything he has given to us. Let it work for you. It has worked for us. It has made us great. It has made us nobody to stand before kings and queens. What about you? Let it work for you. If you be coming to this church, you will see that we are always growing from glory to glory to glory. Thank you. Let it work for you. You cannot be coming to TMG and what you used to go through in life will now be reoccurring. No. You are under an active grace. This grace is active. I don't have to touch you first. It's contagious. It's active. Your life cannot be the same. Right? Huh? There's one of my pastors. Where's Pastor Onome? Pastor Onome is there. He has masters in engineering. And when he met me, he came. He's the only son of his dad. And you know, big man became only son. And he said, Prophet, I want to work with you. Right? Say, Prophet, that was about six years ago. Say, I want to work with you, Prophet. I said, Please go, go, go. All the people that are coming around are either thieves or dupes or liars. I don't want anybody to work with me. He said, No, Prophet. I'm very serious. And I'm not a dupe, I'm not a thief, I'm not a liar. I said, okay, then we shall see. He started working, living in my house, just doing every walk. Left his father's mansion, came to my house. And he started working. I discovered he's very lazy, you know. Rich man became must be lazy. Eh? The guy has help, they get everything. The father senior staff in NPC. I said, you are very lazy, you are not like a must. One day he told me, say, prophet, I have left my parents' house severally. Ah, can I have a microphone, please? Severally, so I must come back. I say, eh. He said, yes. I've left to Lagos. I started working. I came back to my mother's house again. I, eh? Is it true? It's true, sir. You told me that. Just stay there. Don't worry. The camera is speaking to you. You told me that if you leave. My NYC, I had to even work it. I lobbied for it to move to Lagos. Oh, you lobbied in your youth service yes, so to I move you to Lagos. to Lagos. To Lagos. Yes, sir. And okay. I finally got it. And I started there uh, with the NYC. Then during the NYC, I, I was privileged to went to, I went to synagogue and I had an opportunity to handle a contract. But the contract... You were not given a contract. A contract a you went to synagogue first. Yes, sir. They then prayed for you. Yes, sir. When you left there, you got a contract. I got a contract. The contract, they now fought me. At the end of the day, I ended up in debt and everything crumbled. I went back home again. And you came back to your mother's house again? Yes, sir. You started begging food in the kitchen? Yes, sir. You go and own generator? Yes, sir. You sweep compound? Yes, sir. You lock gates? Yes, sir. They will send you message? Yes, sir. Go buy fuel. Go buy fuel. Ah! You are the man of the house. So before you met me, Yes, sir. And when you came, you told me that you always go back home. Yes, sir. In you... fact, before, before I met you, I used to come to normal services like this. And there is, there is this word I, I always knew. They say the gift of a man make it way for him. But I, me now being very lazy, I thought within myself, what is it I can do? I check, check, check. There is nothing I can call as my gift. But I only discovered that because my father had several cars. I used to drive anyone I can drive. Okay, Big now man, Pekin. Yes, and I felt, okay, 
Driving is the only thing I can do, do it with ease. And that's why I now started as a sir. There was a vacuum. I think Brian Moss then traveled out and I saw the vacancy that you needed somebody to be running errands for you. And I felt, okay, that's an opportunity for me to start. And that's how I started, sir. So you now came? Yes, sir. Yeah? Yes, sir. You started driving? Yes, sir. And you told me you might likely still go back home to your father's house again. I was still going back. It was even you that advised me that I should pack my things and leave the house. And I was now wondering, how would I leave the house? That period, you two, you said God told you to leave your house and go to, to the church in Ekrejebo there for effective administration. And that was how you now left your house to the office. In fact, the office was very small there, no extension. And I followed you. You will stay in your own office, inner office. I will stay in the outer office. And that was how we were sleeping. We for sleep. three months? Yes, sir. For three Mama months? I was bringing food for us. They will you, bring food. You, I left my own house. Yes, sir. To office for three months. A program oh, eh? so that I can separate myself. He also left his father's house. And you could not go back again? No, sir. You could not go back again? No, sir. So to today, how many fact, years now? More than four years now. If more I go four. home... I don't even eat. I don't drink. I don't drink. I make sure I don't eat anything from the house. I make sure I don't drink anything. I even barely sit down. I don't so sit now home. you will not come back again? No, sir. And this is the longest time that you have that, left? Yes, sir. That you could not... Would you still go back? There is no trace that I can even go back there, sir. Because God has blessed me to the point that I'm even sending money to them at home. Now you even send money? The, the last bond, our last bond... It's my responsibility. I support her. In school? Just, yes, sir. Eh? At times you pay her school fees. Yes, sir. Send her money. Now you are married. She has graduated now. She has she, even graduated. She's going for NYC. I will still send her money. You will still send her money? This week coming. So now you no more go back home again? No, sir. So the power could not take you back again? At all. Can you celebrate this? <laughs> Thank you. Sir, I'm trying to talk to you. His own case, there are a lot of you that are going through it. You always go back. If you go forward, you always go back. So when you meet grace, you cannot go back. You cannot go back. That is the growth. This is the growth I'm talking about. Spiritual growth. You cannot tell me you are a man of God. You have grown and you are poor. God does not work like that. Huh? God does not work like that. Even if you choose to be poor, you will find yourself in money. You cannot tell me that God is using you or you are serving a living God, but your living God is a poor God. It doesn't work like that. It's only native doctors that can make people rich and they are poor. And the people don't even get rich because very soon they die or they go back again. So I want you to change and put my Jesus to test. Please put him to test. Let it work for you. The way it has worked for Pastor Nomen today is married. He has left his parents' houses. He's even the one sending money now. Let your own case be like that. You also have to change. Shake yourself. See the areas you are not doing well and change. It could just be masturbation. Change. It could just be fornication. You, you flirt anyhow. Change. God will not give you money when he knows you will end up spending the money on a prostitute in a hotel. God, don't, God does not bless people like that. God will not bless you when he knows you will end up using the money to take cocaine. God does not work like that. God will not bless you when he knows the car you want to use it to keep people because you'll be driving anywhere along the road. Just be driving so the old world should know that you have bought a car and it's a second-handed car. Tokumbo. You could never hide it. God does not bless like that. God does not invest in failures. If God knows you will fail, he will not invest in you. Now you have God. You cannot be living your life the way you used to live it. Change. Co-work with God. Co-work with God. Always remember God is with you. That is my secret. No matter what I go through, I always remember God is with me. How many of you remembered Jesus is with you today? Okay, every one of you, thank you. 
This morning when you wake up, how many of you remember Jesus was with you? Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Things went wrong for you. How many of you still remembered that Jesus was with you when things went wrong? Are you sure? You remember one man they called Job. The wife said, curse God and die. Curse God. Curse him now. Die. That your church, they will walk. The church, they walk. Now you know if you get money, take your car. The church, now they walk. Have they told you that before? If they never tell you, that means they never start. They must tell you. Forget all this one you wear for neck. Come on, you carry you go. If they don't want to, you don't have man. They don't tell you like that. They don't tell me too. Not be you the first day. They don't tell me. They don't tell me now. When I started this church new, one as about one of these places, one minute day or one place. On a police for road when not get around. Stop me. Say, you are a man of God. You just the fool yourself. True life story. Oh, I come up. Then we were poor. I they use one small Corolla, big Camry. Ah, poverty no good. Oh, reject poverty. <laughs> now, he now say, ah, see, I go just carry you go somewhere. You go get plenty money. Pastors they come there in a road to oh, checkpoint. We've passed Ozoro, Okwale to that Guashi, the road. I didn't look at him. I said, God will have mercy upon you. I started driving away. Huh? Those are the insults of life. Who they so Gary get plan? Don't let that worry you. The Bible said, be anxious for... Don't be... Another thing the devil uses to get us is anxiety. You're anxious. January don't go. January don't go. Nothing happened no. Now, so last year, CBO. Now, February, we don't enter again now. Hey, 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 I must see, eh? I must do it. Anyhow, I must marry. Anyhow. <laughs> Please don't do it anyhow, right? Right? Don't do it anyhow. Please. All that glitters are not good. Not be half far, not well. Not be by January to December. It could just be only two days. Send some, tell somebody two days, two days. Yeah. Only two days, two days, two days. Your story has changed. Two days. Eh? Only one day, one day, one day. Tell somebody one day, one day. My story must change. Just one day. You don't need January to December. It's the truth. You don't need January to December. God has already directed you, spiritual direction. He said this year is your year of celebration. So you are just pushing on. You push on patiently, expectantly, and you are pushing on before you know it. Before you know it. You are the next reigning in time. Before you know it, you are celebrating your marriage. You are celebrating your children. You are dedicating your houses in the name of Jesus. Those of them that mock you, they will come and celebrate with you. In the name of Jesus. God has positioned you. You are on top. You are their head. You are their solution. You are the best of the best. You are the result. They cannot stop you. You are the richest in the family. You will build schools in your communities. You will build hospitals in your communities. In the name of Jesus. Money is your slave. Money is your slave. You will travel all over the world. In the name of Jesus. See, some people travel that in a hurry to look for work. You will not go abroad to look for work. When you enter, you will sit with CEO. You will be discussing discussing boss to boss boss to boss 
you will bring them over to Africa. In the name of Jesus, prepare to own a company. Prepare to own an industry. In the name of Jesus. Why did he die for you? Jesus didn't die for you to be poor. If you don't know, no. He didn't die for you to be what? He said he was rich. Because of you, he became poor. That you, in his poverty, must be what? Must be what? See, I said you are the richest in your family. I don't know how the money will come. Money will come anyhow. In the name of Jesus. See, people will gather position and give it to you. In the name of Jesus. They will have contracts. They will give it to you. In the name of Jesus. I was told they gave you a position. And you didn't work for it. Yes, sir. You didn't even remember. You didn't, were not expecting it. Yes, sir. They just called you. And they gave you a position. On your own no. They gave you a position. Yes. What, is, what is the position? The no, no, not talk plenty. You go down. Just what is the position? The position is the word counselor. It's slot. Yes. That's what they gave you. Yes. A word counselor. Yes. Counselor. Yes. You the hear around. You the, you will give the testimony. No, no. Nah. Counselor. He was on his own. They now called him. They say, Oh boy, you feel prepared. You feel on Sunday oh, that prophet Jeremiah came here. That very Sunday, after the prophet left, they called him up. They said, Oh boy, we don't give you counselor position. You feel manager. You, you fit. He said, Okay, okay. Let me just manage it now. It didn't work for it. He was not expecting it. So when we talk, the word that I speak is spirit and what? Let me tell you, I don't know how you become rich. And I don't want to know how. The money will come anyhow. 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 In the name of Jesus. I don't know how the marriage will come. But it will come anyhow. You will be the one to choose. In the name of Jesus. I have told you. It's the will of God. Whether they like it or not, you must celebrate. Whether they like it or not, you must be celebrated. There are some of you devils are trying to stop your testimony. See, after this service, you must testify. I don't want you to look at your feet. Can you look at your feet? Just look at it. Look at your feet. Can you look at your feet now? Okay, now face me. Face me. Face me. Say the name of Jesus. The powers that head my leg. Powers that head my feet. Say by the power of the Holy Ghost. I overcome you. Eh? I overcome you. Very good. Very good. Overcome it. Eh? Just remove your leg as if your legs are in rope. Eh? Power of the Holy Ghost. 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 Can I see you? Lose them. Lose them. Lose them. Lose them. Lose them. Lose. 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 Holy Ghost. Lose. Who is holding you? What chains? Every fetter. Every power that is holding you in your waist. In your neck, in your leg, anywhere they are, in your waist, in your neck, on your leg, anywhere they are, anywhere they are, loose, 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 holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost, holy ghost. They must leave you. Yes, they cannot stop you. 
Now I release you. For speed. For speed. For speed. For speed. For speed. You greatness. That the heat inside that kofu. Now break out now. Break out now. Break out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. It's okay. Just hold on. Lake Brands and the Harbush. Like a lean the hairs, like the like us, ragabush. They cannot stop you. They are too small. Ah, when devils are tormenting you, it's because you have not grown. They don't torment me. Oh, I don't pray before I sleep. I sleep anyhow. They don't torment me because I've grown. Strive to grow. You need to change to grow. My lady hey bush. Oh, my lady hey bush. Kalande his. Lide brands and the house. Lakalinde his. Loto brands and the hallis. Legalindo hobosh. Whatever. The sword of the Lord is everything. Whatever devils have brought to stop you. Whatever devils. Holy Spirit, can I see your sword in action? Let me see it. Let me see it in action. Whatever devils have brought, let me see you cut them off. Or, or, or slice them off. Whatever devils have brought to stop them. Whatever, whatever. Let me see you slice it all. Or, slice it off. Whatever devils have brought to stop them. To stop marriage. To stop marriage. To stop children. To stop children. To stop money. Let me see it. Power the Holy Ghost. Power the Holy Ghost. Power the Holy Ghost. Power the Holy Ghost. Where are they? Under the water, in the forest, anywhere, in the ground. Let me see you. Let me see you. Hey, hey. They must go. They cannot stand. They cannot stand. They cannot. Now, whatever part of your life, whatever part, any area of your life that is connected to an altar, that is connected to an evil altar. Any area of your life that is still on an evil altar, your child that is on this altar, that they place on the evil altar, that you cannot have the child. Your marriage that is on an altar, evil altar, physically or spiritually, that is stopping you from having the child, the children, the marriage. Your money that is on an altar, evil altar, legelanda habosh kele de hes, lita prasanda habosh, ragebos legelanda sanda, like bronze kolondo hosh. Your visa, your visa, your visa, your visa that is on an altar, physically or spiritually, that is stopping you from traveling. My lady hash. Let the bronze calandes, Ligelanda, Hobosh, Mole, every kind of power. Eh? Marine spirits that they used to lock it. Witchcraft spirits, every kind of power that they used to lock you, to lock your money. Today, by the power of the Holy Ghost, I separate you. I separate you. I scatter it all. Be cut off. 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 Let the hebosh ragebos kele de hes moli de haboshanda lata prans kalande hebolondos ligelende sendo hobosh ragebos. Wow, see money, money everywhere. Money. Oh. Money. If a prophet talk, except it's a fake prophet, if a, a genuine prophet, if he did not see anything, he will not talk. Because he doesn't have to talk, must he talk? But if he sees and he wants to talk, okay, see, I'm seeing money, 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 money plenty money. Yeah? We have to collect all this money first. Some persons are not married now. Because of money. 
Some could not go to school now because of what? That's why the Bible said, Money answered all. Lege Bolanda Habosh, Kelele Hayes, Lide Branzando Hobosh, Makalende Sendo Sundos, Lege Bolanda Habosh. I can see the devils that are tormenting you. God has tied them. Eh? Before we collect this money, let's finish them. Are you still here? Yes. Now, remember devils that have been tormenting you, tormenting your children. Even if you don't know them, just remember the case. Say the name of Jesus. As I stretch my hands on this altar, to this altar, I collect fire. I collect fire to destroy all this devil. Say, you demon that has been tormenting me, you demon, you wishes. That has been pressing me. That has been chasing me in the dream. That has been feeding me in the dream. You demon. That has been making love to me in the dream. You demon. That has been stopping all my expectation. I call you by your name. It's my turn to kill you. Today in the name of Jesus. Fire! 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 is very clear now are you here say the name of Jesus all these my expectations yours might not be money but your expectations go and put my Jesus to test if you ask all over the world if you have just pray this prayer with us. Go put my Jesus to test. You must come back with your testimony. Put Jesus to test. This is TMG. The grace here is active. Very, very active. You don't have to be a member of TMG anywhere you are. Whether you are a Christian or not. Put my Jesus to test. You must testify. My lady Hebosh, Kelly Hebosh, Kelly Hayes, Lodo Branzan, the Haledos, Regebosh, Kalande Hayes. Now we want to collect. Are you still here? Learn to forgive. Learn to do what? Forgive. Are you hearing me? Anybody do you anything? Forgive. Huh? Forgive. Hello, sir. At times we fight, but most times don't fight. Forgive. Overlook. Just put it aside. Where you are going is too big for this crayfish. Right? Crayfish. Forgive. Forgive. Don't miss this Sunday service. Make sure you invite someone to church. Are you ready now? 
See the name. Oh, I'm still seeing money. Oh. <laughs> money. See money. When they say money, hey, are you will not tie to? Well, well, well. You will not tie. It. We are building. You will not buy cement for us. Please buy for us, right? Things are getting higher, costly every day in Nigeria. Not only Nigeria, all over the world. But even if the bag of cement you go to 70,000 for one bag, you will still buy a trailer load. Are you ready now? Yes, Say all this my expectations. All this my expectations. Mama, come, 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 come and join. They will let me pray for women. Bring her microphone for her. Don't worry, just come. They will bring it. Huh? Huh? Come and join me. Pray for the sisters. Are you still here? You are going to pray for the sisters. But let's pray for the money first. Money is more important than marriage. You. Not be so. Yeah. Money not the how the marriage want to work. Not be money be marriage. Ah, uh, married woman money not the with a frown. No, no if you call you honey, oh. call you honey hunger bitter once. Next one, you call your name bitter. Bring food, do. So we we'll pray for the money first. Are you still here? I'm on my way to. Money they meant very, very important. Bible see marriage before it say money answers all things. Say the name of Jesus. All my expectations. As I stretch my hands, I collect you. Very good. Collect this. Collect this to your chest. Put it on your chest. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Stretch your hand there as if you want to carry Ghana must go of money. I collect you. Uh, drag it, drag it. Uh -huh. Drag it, take. Drag it, take. Let's go again, let's go again. Collect it. Put it on your chest. Now you put the hand on the chest like that. Keep it like that. Keep it like that. Power the Holy Ghost. Power the Holy Ghost. Power the Holy Ghost. Break through. Break through. Break through. Break through. Break through. Power the Holy Ghost. Power the Holy Ghost. Power the Holy Ghost. Everywhere. 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 360. 360 degrees. Everywhere. Favor. Unmerited favor. Unmerited favor. Lady Hebo Shondo Hobo Shondos. Wow. Just leave the hand like that. Let it be on your chest. Yes. Let it be on your chest. This one, eh? This one long. It long. You know how money they long? This one long. Eh? From one to one to one to one to one. Like that. Like that. Like that. Eh? You know, you're not going to understand. This one, eh? Long. Eh? You they go from one to one to one to one. One to one to one to one to one to one to one. Like that. It does not stop. Don't let it sink. Let it sink. Let it sink. Huh? This grace is active. Mate kebosh, kelide helbosh, kalande hes, lada branzanda has. You know what you will do now? Can you put out your wedding ring? Pull it in and you say you will give it to anybody. Just pull it. Eh? Yes, see the one I pull my own. Then you hold it like this. Can they see it? Camera, can you see the ring? Put your money on your chest too. This one is for marriage, eh? Just stay there. What happened to your microphone? Just hold it like this. Right? Camera, can we see the ring? That her ring. Eh? Yes, yeah, zoom it for us, eh? And let's see the ring. Zoom only the ring. For all the sisters. Your camera is blurry, no? Okay, nice. See camera. Camera be like Nokia. It's, it's not clear. This one is better. Yes. See how? Would they, would they look for money to buy one camera? 1.5. We'll never see. Now, camera be like Nokia. 
Knock your way, get camera. Eh? Okay. You know, this church, we don't bother you for money. Not that we don't need it. That's why a brother gave me two million era some days ago. He said, Prophet, I want you to tell a pastor to come and pray for my land. I said, Don't worry, I'm coming to pray. He said, eh? I said, I'm coming. I just want to appreciate him. Because we don't ask people for money. The two million means a lot to me. It meant so much. Because I really needed it. I didn't ask who. He just gave one million, gave another one million. This week now. Was it not this week? It's this week. I said, Wow. Eh? Leave him. Um, we'll talk on money. Do what it is the more. I said, no worry, I'll be calling your house. I won't come pray in that your land. Oh, I don't want to know whether it's 40 by 40, 100 by 100, or oh, it's room and parlor house. I'm coming there. When I finish the prayer, you will not start buying lands anyhow. Yes. Huh? It's what the Bible said now. He that giveth a cup of water to a prophet must receive the prophet's reward. Imagine my pastor come to your house, you give him Fanta and uh, buff buff. No wonder your house is full of buff buff. All right, all right. Don't get respect for men of God. Imagine pastor can't do your shy name me. You give her uh, buff buff. Buff buff. A Coca Cola. All those kind of wine. If you drink, finish your porch for five days. All right, all right. Mad people. You must grow, change. You cannot be who you were last year. I don't know me. I'm not a fake man of God, though. I don't misbehave. I don't misbehave. I'm very serious. I may look like a guy, man. Yes, but I'm very, very straight. Okay, mama, let's start our prayer. Are you ready now? Okay, now, those of you that wants to marry, Eh? It's you that will pray the prayers, not me. Put the mic in your mouth, don't worry. Huh? Are you ready now? Show the ring. And she's holding the ring. If you want to marry, tell them that as I'm holding this ring. As I'm holding this ring. If you want to marry. If you want to if marry. If you are a sister here. If I sister here. And you want to marry. And you want to marry. The way God did it for me. The way God did it for so me. So fast. So fast. Collect your ring now. I want you to collect your ring. This now. same God. This same God. We do it for you. We do it for you. Collect your ring. Collect your ring now. Take your marriage. Take your marriage. Just go ahead like that, gently. Go ahead. Collect your ring. Take it. Take it. Your marriage. Your marriage. Take it. Take it. They cannot stop you. They cannot stop you. Take it. Take it. Now. Now. One. Now. One. One. Two. Two. Three. Four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven. Take it, take it, take it, take it. Now, 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 now. Take it. Hold on. Let them take. Yes, yes. Stopping you. Who? Who? Who can stop it? See, whether they turn it upside down. My Jesus is bringing it out. Huh? Oh, you don't know. It's TMG now. You turn your marriage upside down. Turn, even you that is married, that is married, that is not enjoying your marriage, they cannot turn it upside down, huh? huh? Why are the angels? Very good. They are bringing it out. Don't worry. Eh? Just wait. Let them do their work. Eh? Let the angels do their work. Very good. The marriage. Go ahead. The marriage. Yeah. Take Go it now. Take. Take it. Take. Take. Yes. Take. Go ahead. Take it. Take it. Take. Take. The marriage. Take. 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 Take it now. The marriage. Take it. Take now. it. Who is now. stopping you? Take it now. Now. Power the Holy Ghost. 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 Holy Ghost. Say whatever power, whatever power that is this saying no. That is this saying as, no. I hold this ring, as I hold this receive ring, fire, receive fire, fire, receive 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 fire,
yes, yes, yes. Yes. That power that is stopping you. Yes. Yes, yes. to touch your back like this. If you want to marry you, you want can, to marry, can you touch, touch your back. back? Just touch your back. Touch your back. Touch your back like this. Touch your back. Touch your back like this. Try, try, try your best. Touch your back. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Hit it. That power that is always removing you removing from good, good relationship. Break, 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 Whatever they are using to draw you back, 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 to your parents' house, to draw you back, to your own house, to draw you back from your marriage. Break, 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 Very good, very good, very good. Very good. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Say the name of Jesus. The name of Jesus. I collect the marriage. Collect Say, the I collect marriage. my marriage. I collect 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 my children. I collect my children. Go ahead, collect, collect. Collect, collect, collect. Collect, collect the marriage now. Collect the marriage. 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 Collect the I collect my marriage. Collect Even marriage. you that is married, Even collect your marriage. Collect, collect your marriage. real marriage. Collect your yeah, marriage. The enjoyment of your marriage. The, enjoyment the, wealth of your marriage. the wealth of your marriage. Good health in your Good marriage. Health in your marriage. Collect, collect, it. Collect, it. Now, collect it. Collect it. Money in your marriage. Money in your marriage. Yeah. Collect, collect it. Collect it now. Collect the enjoyment in your marriage. Collect it now. Collect it now. Collect it now. Can you go ahead now? Then hold it. So you can can you position someone should hold mic for you? Don't worry, I will hold the mic for you. Huh? Go ahead. Okay. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say I shall wear this marriage ring. You repeat after me. Say I shall wear this marriage ring. I shall wear I shall wear this wedding ring. I wear my wedding gown now. I wear my wedding ring now. I wear my wedding ring. I receive my marriage. 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 Yes, yes. I receive your marriage now. Yes, I receive your yes. marriage now. As you have wore this marriage dream. I must wear. I, I must wear. enjoy my marriage. See, I must enjoy Whether my they marriage. like it or not. Whether they like See, it just stretch your hand up. Whether there is a ring or not. Stretch it up. Stretch it up. Stretch it up. I must enjoy my marriage. They cannot stop. Stretch it up. 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 I must enjoy my marriage. They cannot stop me. Stretch it up, stretch it up. They cannot stop me. I must enjoy my marriage. I must enjoy my marriage. They cannot stop me. They cannot stop me. I must enjoy my marriage. I must enjoy my marriage. I must enjoy my marriage. They cannot stop me. They cannot stop me. I must enjoy my marriage. I must enjoy my marriage. In Jesus' mighty name. Celebrate Jesus. Are you still here? I said on Sunday, try your best to invite someone. Are you still here now? Say I'm a testimony. My life will shock them. 
my life will shock all of them. Eh? Before they know it, I'm already there. Celebrating. So shall it be. So shall it be. So shall it be. Now in the name of God, the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, I open it for you. This payment, this payment, your money, your money that they have refused to give to you, if I be a man of God, I open it for you. Let them all be open. 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 Money will come anyhow. In the name of Jesus. Let it be open. Your finances are open. Your finances are open. Your marriage is open. In the name of Jesus. You are secured. The roads are safe for you. The airways are safe for you. The waterways are safe for you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Go. You must come with a testimony. Russia!